The InStar mixing system is a one-of-a-kind product in the world of miniature painting and provides painters with a complete tool set to create an unlimited amount of colours with any kind of finish. In essence, a painter can make their own paint set that is entirely unique to them. Now, we realise that for most people, colour mixing can come across as a bit scary, but even if you don't understand how colour mixing works, we've taken a lot of the hard work out of it and reduced the fear factor by providing mixing recipes on our website, which you can also access by scanning the QR code on the back of the mixing kit. All the recipes are extremely easy to follow and the conversion calculator will run you through the steps of how to convert the recipes into millilitres to fill up the bottles. Inside the kit, you'll find two types of syringes. A general purpose one that holds 10 millilitres of paint and increases in 0.1 millilitre increments, and an advanced syringe that holds 1 millilitre of paint and increases in 0.01 millilitre increments. These come with plastic dispensing tips for safety. There are also 15 empty bottles that come with agitators, plugs, and caps to get you started, 12 50 millilitre storage containers, one 150 millilitre storage container. 12 50 milliliter bottles of the core pure colors and one 150 milliliter bottle of pure white as this color is used a lot in color mixing you'll also notice there are no extra plastic parts or extra cardboard inserts in the pack this is all part of our effort to become more eco-friendly by reducing the amount of packaging involved in the product everything in the pack with the exception of the paint itself is fully recyclable and extends to the bottles which we'll get to later to get started, simply open up one of the storage pots, then take one of the bottles, give it a good shake and pour it into the container making sure the agitator goes with it. Then carefully remove the label from the bottle and attach it to the pot using a small piece of clear tape if needed. That pot will now be used again and again with subsequent refills for that particular colour. Then just repeat the process for the other colours, install the pots on your hobby desk or leave them in the box ensuring they are all up the right way. Making the colour is extremely simple and straightforward. On this Dark Angel model, we particularly like the gold element that's been put here on the weapon and we want to transfer those colours to this model. But because we like it so much, we're going to make the colour up in bottles so we don't have to make it every single time on the palette. We've already added the swatches to one of the printable swatch cards available from the website and recorded the colours and the number of drops used but we need to convert this into milliliters so we know how much to put into a bottle so we'll need to use a conversion calculator to tell us how to convert it from drops to milliliters since this is a color we'll only be using for trims and icons we'll only need five milliliter bottles of it but the converter will work for any size bottle if you prefer to source your own following the instructions on the calculator We've written down how many milliliters of each colour we'll need to replicate the colours that we made up earlier on the palette. Taking one of the general purpose syringes, attach the dispensing tip making sure it's on tight and then find the first colour you need, in this case magenta. Then putting the tip below the surface of the paint, draw up around 2 milliliters of paint and then push the plunger back down so that you expel any excess air in the barrel, then draw the paint up again to the desired level. Because we'll also need to use the advanced syringe for this colour, we'll only draw one milliliter of paint. Then take your bottle, make sure the tip is inside it, and then dispense the paint into the bottle. Repeat the same process with the advanced syringe, but you will need to draw up and expel the air twice to make sure that you draw up the paint sufficiently. With the advanced syringes, it's normal to have a small gap, though the smaller you can make it, the better. Once the first colour is complete, Repeat the same steps until all the colours have been added to the bottle. Then simply add an agitator, push in the plug, screw on the lid and give the bottle a good shake to combine the colours. Then take a sharpie or other fine marker pen and write down the colour formula on the bottle. Then take a piece of clear tape, place it over a label to protect it and that's all there is to it. Now I did mention before about the recycling going further to the bottles. Now that you have a colour made up, when this runs out, it is as simple as taking the plug out and re-adding the, the colour recipe back into the bottle, replacing the plug and cap and giving it a good shake. It doesn't matter if there's any paint left in the bottle as it will be the same colour so you don't have to throw it out when the paint bottles have been used. And that's pretty much all there is to it. It's a really simple system and really powerful at the same time. 
The next time you need a colour, it will literally be at your fingertips.